James White in the backfield with him. And Sam retreats. Here comes good pressure by the Hawkeyes. He's bear hugged as he throws the ball away. Picked off by Morris. He's at the 40. He's at the 35 yard line. It's a foot race. 30, 25 yard line. James Morris took the ball away from the slot receiver. And the Hawkeyes have a chance for another score. Nelson pump fake shorts over the middle. Intercepted James Morris. James Morris comes up with a pick. They're now four for five on fourth down. And we got our player of the game, I think. I, at least that's where my vote is going. Well, it's got to be somebody from defense. Yeah. Right now, they just want to get the ball back. Here's Cook retreating to throw again. All kinds of time. Pass is tipped up in the air, deflected, and intercepted. Intercepted by James Morris. James Morris, back-to-back -back weeks with interceptions, and hopefully that fires up and ignites this Hawkeye offense as Iowa has it first and 10 at the Michigan State 33. Twin receivers to the right, single receiver to the short side of the field, and it's picked off again as Kellogg tried to throw to the slot receiver, and James Morris comes away with another steal. Here he is again, play fake, rolls right, throws to his tight end, he makes the catch, he's hit by Kirksey, Kirksey picks up the loose ball, it's on the ground, he's gonna go for the touchdown, touchdown Iowa, off the fumble by Luke Ekus, how quickly momentum can turn. Oh boy, did the Hawkeyes need that. Boy, did they need that. A great job by Kirksey of reading the fake and then the quick throw to the slot man. He hit him so hard and right on the ball and then was such a great athlete he could just reach down and pick it up and take off. Let's see what Jake Rudock does here. He's going to throw. Retreats from his 15 yard line, fires upfield, and it is caught by Doozy. Does he have enough speed to get to the end zone? He does! Touchdown, Iowa, no flags. Touchdown, touchdown, Iowa. Oh my goodness, what a turn of events. Jake Doozy lined up outside right, and 85 yards later, Rudock threw a beautiful pass to him, caught it in stride, and he was off to the races. And now we await the punt. And it's a straight on punt with the breeze. Uh, Mark Manley should be able to return this. Catches at the 18. Cuts back to the middle of the field. 35-40. 45-50. Got one guy to beat. Down this near sideline. One man to beat. 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Iowa. Touchdown, Iowa. Touchdown, Kevontae Martin Manley. Well, he had a career high 44 yards to begin the game. He just went 82 yards. Here comes the low line drive kick fielded by... You know who, Kevate Martin Manley. He's loose again. He angles toward the wide side of the field, toward the Western Michigan bench, turns it upfield. He goes to the sideline. He's going to go again. Back-to-back -back punt returns. Touchdown, Iowa. Touchdown, Iowa. Kevate Martin Manley follows up an 82-yard punt return with a 63-yard score. Here we go. Timeout's over. Empty backfield. Five receivers. Fourth down and eight. Here comes the snap. Colder looks down the middle of the field. Iowa puts a good put pressure on him. He's rolling out to his right. Now he's trying to run for it. Knocked down at the 19, or excuse me, the 24. Game over. Game over. It's happy hour in Iowa City. And Richardson on second down, 10 at the Iowa 46. You know he's got to be looking his way, and he is. Blitz coming. He gets rid of the football, and it is incomplete. Well, picked off. Intercepted by B.J. Lowry. The ball was a little bit underthrown. He was looking for Jarvis West, and B.J. undercut the route and picked it up. B.J. Lowry. Slot, Martin Manley and Fedorowicz. Tavon Smith to the bottom of the field. Therefore, it's an empty backfield. Rudock's got to get rid of it in a hurry, and it's caught by Smith. What a grab. And he runs out of a tackle. He's heading to the end zone. 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown! Touchdown, Iowa! What a catch by Smith! And then he did the rest with his legs. That young man has really come along this year. He caught it out on his hands, and we talked about how difficult that was going to be today. But he did, and then stopped and changed direction. And that's just what the Hawkeyes needed on their first series. Damon Powell is on the field, empty backfield. That means there's a tight end out there as well. Jake's got to get rid of it. Blitz, they get it to Powell on the uh, screen pass, and he's gone. 50, 40, 35, 30, 25, 20. Forget about it. Nobody's going to catch Damon Powell. Did he pad his per catch average there? Yards per catch. Touchdown, Iowa. 74 yards. Unbelievable.
a bubble screen. They let the defensive lineman come roaring in. They were going to get to the quarterback, and that was run to perfection. Hawks are 5 for 13 on third down. Blitz coming. Rudock just throws it up for grab. Caught! Touchdown! How in the world did C.J. Fedorowicz get to it? Or better yet, how did Rudock see him clearing with a full-out safety blitz? Nobody picked up the blitzing defensive back, and that is just a great play by Rudock to put enough air under the ball that Fedorowicz could turn around and see it coming. Here's Gardner in the shotgun. Yes, yeah, a quarterback draw all the way, and look out, he's loose at the Iowa 31-yard line. Bubble, bubble, bubble. The ball. It's stripped. Hawkeye it's ball. ball! The Hawkeyes have it. Gardner gained 10 yards and then gave up the football. And it might have been Anthony Hitchens. They're all hugging him. There's Armstrong, turns and gives to Abdullah, and he cuts inside James Morris. Ball's loose. Hawks have it. Hawks have it on the turnover. Abdullah was stripped after he tried to get escape James Morris, and I think it was Kirksey or Drew Ott who stripped the ball. One did, it was Louis Trinkapassat who plopped on it. Well, there go the Hawkeyes after White. the Cyhawk Trophy. They're all over yeah, there, huddled around it. That's the bottom line. And the final score, Iowa 27, the Cyclones of Iowa State 21, and the Iowa players race across to the other sideline. Hawkeyes win it over the Minnesota Golden Gophers 23-7 to improve to 4-1 on the year. And, of course, to equally important 1-0 in the Big Ten. And that's it. Nebraska will let the clock run out and celebrate you, Hawk fans. As they, Iowa. they go get the trophy. See the players going over to get the trophy, which will be, come to Iowa City for the first time.